up guys? I just want to again welcome you to the very first BBA networking event. <laughs> Today at this road show, we've got Mon Rachel Gould from Modern Barber magazine. We've got the Hair and the Barbering Council. We've got John Sim from Movember. We've got a social media expert. We've got Salon Services talking about retail. And then we've got the whole BBA team talking about education, membership, and accreditation. Social media, in many respects, is your shot window to the world. And it's a great opportunity, obviously, to sell your products, to give you uh, your business a human touch, um, and actually to network. Uh, just by the point of you being here, you're all committed and, and hopeful, great professionals trying to, to further our, our industry in the right direction. He said, look, let's do Barber UK and let's bring our competitions over. And we did, and it was a roaring success. Our boxing ring was the highlight of the whole event. And I know that because the people from the beauty, nails industry and hair industry was all coming over to us congratulating how slick it was and what a great event and how good it was to watch. And then becomes the what? The right product, the right price, uh, the convenience, it's there and then. Far easier to be able to retail those kind of products. Nothing to do with uh, barbering, nothing to do with hair or beards or anything. It's all about that kind of client and what they want. We all have to, we're all in this room and we all have a passion. And I think if we engage with each other, if we share the knowledge, and I would love to share with you what you could do to, to actually change the dynamic of the industry. And uh, 11 years later, we've raised £400 million for men's health issues across the world, and we're now active in 21 countries. There will be different tables that you will be going around to actually talk to, network, find out more, kind of talk to each other. It's going to be a great afternoon. It's like a network speed dating. We just want to reinforce to the public, to the consumer, use these guys because they're great at what they do. What they yeah. should be doing is seeing your Instagram account, where it is, display yeah. it somewhere, or your YouTube channel, so they can sit there and go and then follow it. You come in and they ask you a question, and they're in their mind they're thinking, I've got to flog them that, because um, that's going to hit my target, yeah. rather than what the customer really wants. Most people that are taught sort of like through their fingers, everything's in sections like that, and it's like, to see a different set of sneakers will be. It's good to see So I say to my students, because two of us to teach them, I teach them on a Monday, he teaches them on a Tuesday. Yeah. So they see my way, and then they see his way. And I say to them, you'll see somebody else's way. And no way is the wrong way, as long as you get the result. That's the it, right yeah. result. It doesn't matter how you achieve it. That's it. So this is a feature that we're going to be growing, and we want to fill it with really relevant content from the barbering industry. So right through to, to barbers, barbershop owners, men's fashion, men's grooming, and really kind of evolve it as um, a website that your customers can go to as well. I don't just, I don't shave, I don't like just cut hair, I don't know. It's... You are a bit of a fade and blending master, Pete, and your beard well, work is, is amazing. Again, this is, yeah. It's really funny, I ask this question because it's, it's important to identify what we are, who we are. 
as a business owner and a, as a barber, I think it, it's a fantastic event to network with other barbers and other business owners and other like-minded people and to discuss with different governing bodies and different people about different aspects of the business, i.e. the social media aspect and uh, obviously what the Barber Council are doing, I think it's fantastic and also what the British Barber Association are continue to do. I definitely recommend other people in the country coming to the BBA networking events. They're a brilliant day, definitely worth doing. I, I would definitely recommend uh, other barbers from up and down the country to go to regional events, to attend these events, and uh, I think that they'll get a lot out of it. I think it's pretty vital for anyone within the industry, and especially as a business owner as well, not only as a barber, to come to these events. They are, they are fantastic. And thank you so much for coming. It means the world, and we've got many more of these to follow. Thank you.